Electric vehicles have gained significant popularity in recent years as a cleaner and more sustainable alternative to traditional gasoline-powered vehicles. But how do electric vehicles work? In this comprehensive guide, we will delve into the intricate workings of electric vehicles, exploring the technology behind their propulsion, energy storage, and charging systems. By understanding the mechanics of EVs, we can appreciate the advantages they offer and their role in shaping the future of transportation. In today's video, we will be showing you how do electric vehicles work. Without further ado, let's begin. Electric vehicles are automobiles that are powered by one or more electric motors. Unlike conventional internal combustion engine vehicles that rely on gasoline or diesel for propulsion, EVs utilize electricity stored in rechargeable batteries as their primary energy source, converting it into mechanical energy to drive the wheels. Electric motors. At the heart of an electric vehicle are electric motors that provide the necessary torque to rotate the wheels. These motors are powered by electricity from the vehicle's battery pack. There are various types of electric motors used in EVs, including DC motors. Direct current DC motors are the simplest and most common type used in electric vehicles. They consist of a rotor armature and a stator field. When electric current flows through the motor, it creates a magnetic field that interacts with the rotor, causing it to rotate. AC induction motors. Alternating current AC induction motors are another popular type used in EVs. They operate based on electromagnetic induction principles, where a rotating magnetic field in the stator induces a current in the rotor, generating rotational motion. Permanent Magnet Synchronous Motors These motors utilize permanent magnets on the rotor, which interact with the magnetic field produced by the stator. They offer high power density and efficiency, making them well-suited for electric vehicle applications. Battery Pack Electric vehicles store electrical energy in large battery packs that provide the necessary power for the vehicle's operation. These battery packs consist of numerous individual cells connected in series and parallel configurations. The most commonly used battery technology in EVs is lithium-ion, lit-ion batteries due to their high energy density, reliability, and longevity. Lit-ion batteries are made up of multiple cells, each containing a positive electrode, cathode, a negative electrode, a node, and an electrolyte. During charging, electric current flows from an external power source through the battery's management system, causing lithium ions to move from the positive electrode to the negative electrode, where they are stored. During discharge, the stored lithium ions move back to the positive electrode, releasing electrical energy that powers the vehicle. Power Electronics Electric vehicles rely on power electronic systems to control the flow of electrical energy between the battery pack and the electric motors. These systems include inverters, converters, and controllers that manage the voltage, current, and frequency of the electrical signals. The power electronic system converts the direct current, DC, from the battery pack into alternating current, AC, for the electric motors. It regulates the power flow, adjusting it based on the driver's input or the vehicle's operational requirements. Additionally, the power electronic system facilitates regenerative braking a feature in which the electric motor acts as a generator during deceleration or braking. This regenerative braking system captures the kinetic energy of the vehicle, converts it back into electrical energy, and stores it in the battery pack, extending the vehicle's range and improving overall energy efficiency. Charging Systems Level 1 Charging This is the most basic form of charging and involves plugging the vehicle into a standard household electrical outlet using a charging cable. Level 1 chargers typically operate at 120 volts and provide a charging rate of around 2 to 5 miles of range per hour of charging. While convenient for overnight charging at home, Level 1 charging is relatively slow and is best suited for vehicles with smaller battery capacities or for occasional use. Level 2 charging Level 2 charging utilizes dedicated charging stations that operate at higher voltages, typically 240 volts. These stations provide faster charging rates compared to Level 1, delivering around 10 to 30 miles of range per hour of charging, depending on the vehicle and charger capacity. Level 2 chargers are commonly found in public locations, workplaces, and residential settings. They require professional installation and may require the purchase of a separate charging unit. DC Fast Charging DC Fast Charging, also known as Level 3 Charging, is the fastest charging option available for electric vehicles. These chargers operate at high voltage DC power, 
by passing the vehicle's onboard charger and directly charging the battery. DC fast chargers can provide a significant amount of range in a short period, typically offering 60 to 80 miles of range in just 20 minutes of charging, depending on the vehicle and charger capacity. DC fast charging stations are typically found along highways, major travel routes, and commercial charging networks. Range and Efficiency The range of an electric vehicle refers to the distance it can travel on a single charge. The range varies depending on factors, such as battery capacity, driving conditions, speed, and climate. As technology advances, electric vehicles are continually improving their range capabilities, with some models now offering ranges exceeding 300 miles on a single charge. Efficiency is a crucial aspect of electric vehicles. It refers to how effectively an electric vehicle converts electrical energy into mechanical energy to prop all the vehicle. EVs are known for their high energy efficiency, typically converting over 80% of the energy stored in the battery into usable power. Comparatively, internal combustion engine vehicles are significantly less efficient, with most of the energy in gasoline being wasted as heat. Additional Features and Advantages Electric vehicles offer several additional features and advantages over traditional vehicles. Instant Torque Electric motors deliver instant torque, providing quick acceleration and responsive performance, even at low speeds. This feature enhances the driving experience and makes electric vehicles enjoyable to drive. Reduced emissions EVs produce zero tailpipe emissions, resulting in cleaner air and a reduced environmental impact. By transitioning to electric vehicles, we can significantly decrease greenhouse gas emissions and mitigate climate change. Lower operating costs Electric vehicles have lower operating costs compared to gasoline-powered vehicles. Electricity is generally cheaper than gasoline, resulting in reduced fuel costs. Additionally, EVs have fewer moving parts and require less maintenance, leading to potential savings on repairs and servicing. Renewable energy integration Electric vehicles can be charged using electricity generated from renewable sources such as solar or wind power. This integration supports the transition to a greener and more sustainable energy system. Battery Management System BMS. The Battery Management System BMS, is a crucial component of electric vehicles. It monitors and controls the performance, safety, and longevity of the battery pack. The BMS ensures that the cells within the battery pack are balanced, preventing overcharging or overdischarging of individual cells, which can lead to reduced battery life and safety risks. It also provides information on the battery's state of charge, temperature, and voltage, allowing the vehicle's onboard computer system to optimize performance and efficiency. Regenerative braking. Regenerative braking is a key feature in electric vehicles that allows the vehicle to recover and store energy during braking or deceleration. When the driver applies the brakes, the electric motor switches into generator mode, converting the kinetic energy of the moving vehicle into electrical energy. This electrical energy is then fed back into the battery pack, recharging it and increasing the overall energy efficiency of the vehicle. Regenerative braking helps extend the vehicle's range and reduces wear on the traditional friction brakes, leading to less brake pad replacement and maintenance. Thermal Management System Electric vehicles utilize a thermal management system to maintain optimal temperature conditions for the battery pack and other critical components. The thermal management system regulates the temperature by either cooling or heating the battery, depending on the external conditions and battery's operating state. This helps maintain the battery's performance, efficiency, and longevity. Additionally, the thermal management system ensures that the temperature-sensitive components, such as the power electronics and electric motor, operate within their optimal temperature, ranges for efficient and reliable operation. Vehicle to Grid V2G Technology Electric vehicles equipped with vehicle to grid V2G technology have the ability to discharge energy from their battery back into the power grid. This technology enables electric vehicles to serve as mobile energy storage units, allowing them to supply electricity to the grid during peak demand periods or when renewable energy generation is low. V2G technology offers the potential for grid stabilization, demand response, and increased integration of renewable energy sources, further enhancing the sustainability and flexibility of electric vehicles. Charging Infrastructure The growth of electric vehicles is supported by the development of charging infrastructure. Charging stations are installed at various locations, including public spaces, workplaces, commercial centers, and residential areas, to provide convenient access to charging facilities. 
Different types of charging stations, such as Level 2 chargers and DC fast chargers, offer varying charging speeds and compatibility with different electric vehicle models. Rapid expansion of the charging network is critical to address range anxiety concerns and promote the widespread adoption of electric vehicles. So guys, let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. For more interesting content, give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. Have a nice day and I will see you in the next video.